Hello, my name is Oscar, and I want to show you around my school. Our school is located in the middle of the Bafo Forest. Our campus has the elementary school, the middle school, and the high school. Our high school is very modern, and we're approaching it now. This is the high school here at ISB. We have five floors with all the different IB subjects being taught. This is the floor 200 commons. Here we have the head of high school office with the head himself. This is the IV examinator's office. This is also a study area where we have the CAS office and the main IV coordinator office right here. Through this corridor, we have the social and emotional counselor, where she is always accessible if you need to talk to her. Here we have the student and career counselors. We can help you with college and career choices in the future. They're always accessible, and it's really a big help. Here we have another study area. Here, the faculty has their faculty main area. Here is the atrium where students can hang out, eat their lunch, and do their work. When we go down the stairs, we get to the floor 100 commons. In this area, we have classrooms of the intensive learning support, which need extra help with their learning. We also have the offices of the language teachers. Here we have classrooms for the different languages. We have French, Spanish, and all the different levels A, B, and ab initio taught here. This is the classroom where I have my French ab initio. Through here, we have many of the human sciences classes, like economics, business management, and uh, history. We also have the English A courses with language and literature. Through here we have an office area for where we can print our documents and also a great middle high school library where we can always get help from the IT and the librarians. Our librarians are always there to help with citations for our essays or for the extended essay. The IT department is also very helpful when we have technical problems with our computers that can disturb our learning. We also have a media room where we can do fun effects with green screens and have camera equipment that we can also take from the library, like gimbals for phones and also cameras. Here we have the teacher's office quarters where they also can do the work in the 300 commons. Here's the 400 area commons with mathematics classrooms and science classrooms and the main science lab. The lab is one of my favorite places in the school because when I have my IB biology class, we always do really fun experiments. We have done experiments with potatoes and osmolarity, and it's really fun to understand why things happen. Really like it. So if you don't have any personal examples, this one, I think, Sadie, you have to put an outline. 
up the elevator from the previous floors, we get to the 500 commons, which is the last floor in the high school. All the floors have designated areas for seating and studying, where students can talk to teachers and discuss and work together. Here we have units for computer science. And here we have 3D printers for the design tech classes. Here are some objects students have made with the 3D printers. The design technology classroom has a lot of different instruments and machines to help students create what they have designed. In these classrooms, we have other social sciences and math classrooms. Here, they're taking HL biology. And right next door, sports science is taking place. As we exit the high school and we walk down the pathway, we get to the Student Activity Center, or also called the Annex. Here's the main red gym. Here's the other gym, the blue gym. Through a corridor leading from the annex, we get to the big ISB theater where we host our yearly plays. Last year, it was Aladdin. Right next door from the theater, we have one of our many piano rooms. Upstairs from the annex, we get to our two art rooms. The first classroom has a lot of visual arts with textiles and design. And the second one is more oriented towards drawing and printmaking. Here we have all supplies necessary for art. Up here leads to the music classrooms. A little while walk from the high school, you get to the Metairie, which is also a place where students do music, mainly choir and strings. 